Hello and welcome to a sponsored video featuring the lovely looking Super Catboy. Thank you very much to Pixel Pogo and Assemble Entertainment for providing access to play the game, which is actually available right now on Steam. And if you get there before Monday the 31st, you can pick it up for a 20% discount as well. Super Catboy is an action platformer harking back to the good old days of pixel graphics and 90s nostalgia. And I'm very excited to play it because as you can tell by the music, it's got a very good soundtrack as well. So we're going to get in, play the first few levels, probably about 20-25 minutes or so. You know the drill by now. This is a very different game for me, to be honest. I've spent months fighting zombies, monsters, monstrous humans, and all sorts of nastiness. So it's going to be pretty fun to get into a silly, nostalgic, action-packed platformer and do something different. And I'm very excited to try it out. So, I don't know a lot about this game, other than the fact that it is, like I said, an action platformer, and also you play as a cat. A cat that walks on two legs. Will there be other animals that walk on two legs? I would kind of assume so. I don't know what kind of world we're jumping into, but we'll find out as we go. And we're starting with a cutscene. Cutscenes, baby. Let's go. That is a bizarre plane. And that's us. Oh, we got a little chunk missing out of our fuzzy little ear. Oh my goodness me, there's a snooty husky wearing a military outfit. <laughs> I love the walking animations. Do they all- I wonder if, like, how many breeds of dog there are. And whether they all have different walking animations. <laughs> this droopy dog looks, uh... <laughs> looks like he's panicking. Oh goodness me. Why are we in a tank, though? Who is this? They've got a hover bike. I really don't know how much story there is in this game. Absolutely not a clue. There might not be a story at all. You might just be a cat shooting things. But right now, we're a cat taking a nap. Wow, that just popped right on. How did how did his arms get through the armholes? And we're up. We're straight in. Okay, no sort of intro whatsoever. Uh, okay, we can duck. We can run. I love our running animation. Like our arms out. Uh, okay, we have a jump. Uh, oh, we have an attack. Uh, okay, we don't have a an, anything for our circle or triangle buttons. Uh, I am playing this on PC just for reference, but I'm using a PS5 controller just for ease. Okay, we have punch and we have jump. That's it so far. There's, it's interesting that there's not been any... Also, now I'm just fighting dogs. It's interesting that there's not been any sort of, like, tutorial yet. Oh, that's why we have the duck. I thought that would be the case. There hasn't been any sort of tutorial yet. Like, there's been no part of this game that's told me how to do things or what we're doing. But I probably want that. Ooh, okay. Puzzle pieces. I just got punched by a dog. That's not something I thought was going to happen today. Why did I break that? I feel like I shouldn't have broken that. Was that going to be used in some way? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, well, she's having a great time. How many guns have you got? Oh my god, she's got everything. A woman after my own heart. That's what you get for messing with me. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Everyone's so, like, wiggly. Whoa, who, or better yet, what are you? First some stinking mogrels on two legs, and now you? What else will fall from the sky today? You seem to be alright, though, unlike those stinking clown dogs. Here, take this gun. So the lesson is, if you see uh, a cat walking on two legs wearing a jacket in the middle of a forest, you just give it a gun. Alright. I mean, I, I believe it. I believe it, for sure. Ucha! I'm just breaking those for no reason. I don't know if they drop things, but... Oh, we, we do have an ammo count, and we should... Nope, too late. We do have an ammo count, and I'm a... What? I'm a... What? Assuming that's a check checkpoint. <laughs> Hello, dog. That, that was just a pug. He was just... Minding his business. I do find it kind of odd that there hasn't been any sort of like tutorial. Can we? Oh, oh, we can like hang on walls and there's puzzle pieces. Okay, well I've got to get that. Okay, 
Okay, hang on. Hang on. Oh, oh, okay. The wall jumping feels a little bit weird. You kind of have to, like, jump and then push in a direction rather than the other way. Because if you just push right, you just fall off the wall. So you kind of need to, like, jump and then push right. That's a little bit... That's going to take some getting used to. Ooh! <laughs> Cat food? Cat food equals health. Oh, that's how we use the gun. Again, there hasn't been any sort of tutorial yet, so... It's, uh, it's circle or B to use the gun if you're playing on a controller. Whoop. Oh, okay, pugs just go down in one hit. Understandable, to be honest, if you've ever seen a pug in real life. Woohoo! I wonder if we have, like, limited lives. I would assume we do. This feels very, like, 90s arcade game. Oh, hello. How do I get to that puzzle piece? This way? Ah, ha, ha, yes, this way. I love the, uh, the claw marks on the wall when you're, like, sliding down them. Doink! Oh, we do have lives. We have ten now. Oh, okay, so if you collect all of those, you get an extra life. And we probably should have guessed that we start at nine lives, given that we are a cat. Cat food! Checkpoints. Alright, doggo. Whoops! Whoosh! Oh my god, we got, like, combos. Whoa! Goodness me, I love the, the snooty huskies. They've got kind of a, you know, a very confident air to them when they walk around. Uh, oh my goodness, that was shaky. I think I got shot by a pug. That's not something I expected to happen today. Get out of here. Whoa! Okay, the huskies are a force to be reckoned with, clearly. They've got SMGs. Oh. Level 1 complete already. 100%, 100%, 100%. I am maybe the greatest Super Catboy player there is. I'm just saying. Right, level 2? Question mark? Okay, there's our cutscenes. Oh, this is cool. We've got like a little world map and everything as well. That's neat. We've got a little oil rig over there. There's like a desert train. There appears to be a, a power plant that may or may not be fueled by a volcano. I don't know how those are connected, but I'm sure we'll find out later in the game. Right, level two then. Let's go. I'm really enjoying this after one level. <laughs> I really like the art style. The animation is very cute. I really like the uh, the facial expressions of this girl as well. Oh, it's you again, little house cat. There's something fishy going on here. Just taking a chill walk in the woods. And all of a sudden... Why I got a rocket launcher on me? Target practice. Duh. Use your brain. Obviously. Listen up, them dogs be looking for you or what? My ride's parked nearby, so I'm a bounce. Okay, well, <laughs> understandable, have a nice day. I'm guessing the, the clothed dogs are not a usual occurrence in this world. Feels like everyone's very ah! concerned <laughs> about the clothed animals walking around. Especially the dogs, they're up to something. Okay, I wanted to see if there was like a treasure down there and I think I almost died. Although dying to gravity would not be... How? <laughs> Surprising for me if you've ever seen any of my streams. Huh. I feel like it's probably quite obvious where we can jump down and where we can't. So I'm just gonna not jump down every hole I see. I'm gonna commando crawl right up this rope though. What up? Oh, I like those dogs. Poor little guy. But why are they after me? That's my question. Why are the dogs... Why were the dogs keeping me in a tank? On their airship? And why are they trying to kill me? All these questions, and what on earth is that? I'm judging... From the, uh, the shape of the coins that I need to jump on you. Huh. Oh, goodness me. Oh, I can jump on enemies as well. Okay. Well, that's good to know. I, I'm not sure how that will help me, but I'm sure it will at some point. Huh. Hey. Oh, missed that one. Oh, well, there goes one of our lives. And we're back to nine. We are back to being a normal cat. Ooh, ooh, okay. That's got to get the timing right on those. Get out of here. This is great. This feels like one of those just games that I would play for hours on, like, older consoles. Stuff like the N64 and, like, the Game Boy and stuff. It feels exactly like that. It's been so long since I played a game like this. Which is... Whoa! 
Oh my god, what a move! Okay, I still got pistol whipped and shot a little bit, but... Ow. Oh, I see you down there. Wait, am I just meant to... Okay, well, I mean, I see a collectible. Surely it wouldn't kill me. How do I drop? Oh, like that. Oh! <laughs> there was a trampoline down there. All right, never mind. Woohoo! Oh, man. I'm really enjoying this. The art style is very, very cute. And it's so colorful as well. It's so nice to be playing a super colorful game again. Dude, you can't keep up at all. Take these. I've got shoes now. You can't see it behind the webcam, but I have shoes now! Oh, yeah! Thank you, friend. Um, you didn't tell me how to use them, though. Just gonna push buttons. Oh! Oh! Okay. Shoulder buttons. Shoulder buttons is how I use those. We have a dash! Ah, I did not dash far enough! <laughs> okay. Whoa, that's how you do it. Okay. That needs a, a little... Whoa! A little work on the timing with the old dash boots, but that's very cool. <laughs> oh yes, my loot sensors kicked in. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Try and duck the knife, Zion. Great job. Great job. <laughs> oh man, I could play this all day to be honest. I won't for the purposes of the video, but I could. Hit you with a little goomba stomp. Oh wow, you can actually defeat enemies like that. Okay. If you bounce on them hard enough. Oh. Hey, I got my life back that I lost. Oh my goodness me. I barely even made that. Hey! Howdy, partner. Oh, it's such a cool bike. I want one. I'm done with this forest. It smells like mutt, and I think I just got bit by a flea. Let's bounce to my crib, furball. You call him furball. I love that we've been out, out in this forest for like 10 minutes and we have a new best friend. Oh, 100% again. I'm so good at this. I'm going to regret that any minute now, but... Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, we're on a bike. Am I in control? I am in control. Okay. Can I... Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> can we can we jump the bike? Whoa, easy now. Oh, wow, that's... Okay, interesting. The the hitboxes on on this level seem to be a bit, a bit funky. All right, we'll figure that out. This is not going to be a 100%. I can feel it. Right now. Oh, we need to be aiming sort of like at shoulder height to hit them. Oh God, it's kind of making my eyes go funny. Oh, yeah. The, okay, the hitboxes are really weird. I've got to be in a very specific place to pick everything up. Get out of here. Okay, it's easier to shoot forward than it is backwards for sure. Have that. This might take some getting used to this one. Get out of here, husky. Oh my god, I'm just furiously weaving. I think quantity over quality of shots is going to be the key here. Fire a lot of bullets and eventually one of them will hit the machine gun toting huskies. Oh goodness me, now this Oh, and I'm firing the wrong way. Okay, hang on. It's alright, it's alright. I just forgot how to do anything. Oh, I've only got one health left as well. Uh-oh. How long's left of the level? Do I even want to know? I don't think I do. This may take a retry. Ooh! Pick up all the things, pick up all the things. Oh, we've only got two pieces so far. That's not... Yep. <laughs> I was going to say, that's not a good sign. Do we start back at the beginning of the level? I feel like we do. Oh, we can use the D-pad as well. That's kind of nice. Oh, I've already lost three health. What a fool. Oh, it's really hard to dodge that and shoot at the same time. It's taken me until this attempt to realize and find out that you have a melee attack. <laughs> Which does make this a lot easier, and I wish I'd known about that earlier. How bit of that? Because they can't even shoot you when you're inside them. Big brain. Top tips right there. Top tips. These levels are definitely not my strong suit. <laughs> oh my goodness me. Put me back on foot. I'm better when I'm on my paws. Take that, husky. Give him a slap. He's a proper, like, backhand as well. Much easier for dealing with the ones behind you. I feel like I've got this now. I do find it odd that there's no sort of tutorial. Like, it doesn't tell you how to do all these things. Which I'm assuming it probably does in the controls menu, but I do find it a little odd that it doesn't sort of have even a pop-up that says, hey, press this and do this. We've got quite a range on the, uh, the melee slap as well. 
I'm rid of that. Now we're cooking with gas. Oh my goodness. Right, pick up all the things. I don't think I've missed any of the puzzle pieces yet. For this level. What are we up to? We're up to two. Okay, so we're about halfway through. Take that. Just trying to avoid the gunfire ahead of us. Oh my goodness, it's close. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> we're okay. We're alive. Everything is fine. Pick up all the stuff. Hopefully don't get attacked again. I really love- Wow, look at this trail of coins. God, that's really hard to keep up with on the screen. That's kind of making my eyes cross. Good lord. Hey, we did it. Beautiful. Okay, we got all the cat parts. The rest of it, not so much. But, <laughs> that level was a lot easier once I figured out you had a melee attack as well. I wish I'd known that to start with. We lost many lives to the motorbike level. Who is this jolly man? Where did I put my ladder? The plums won't harvest themselves. Oh, hello. Is that a kitty cat? Hello. <laughs> Folks call me Gadget Grandpa. And who are you, my little friend? Whatever. You guys want some fresh apricot tarts? Sure. Question is, why have you got a hover bike and not a hover lawnmower? Also, our friend here, her head has swollen. She is very angry. <laughs> I've only just noticed, looking at her, like, flailing arms, that her arms, like, spiral and go all wobbly. That's quite amusing. <laughs> There's no time for that now, Grandpa. The whole world is probably in danger. Hmm. Well, first, come on in. And everyone relaxes. You can't be mad when there's a nice Grandpa around. <gasps> He's got, like, a whole garage and a lot of guns. Okay! There was a huge explosion in the sky, and then suddenly there are dog soldiers lurking everywhere with guns, and they walk on two legs. Like that one. Me? Hmm, I wonder if that might be connected somehow. Last night I saw an airship being loaded at the old villa. I'm gonna have to just disappear for a second. The old villa Ungafug. Just to really give you some, some idea of what kind of words we're dealing with here. The old villa Ungafug. That old codger, I think he's creepy. Even back in the day at the academy, he was always trying to do the impossible. Genetic experiments, he called it. But he never got anywhere. Well, that would explain a lot of things in this game. Oh, the kitty cat is wearing my dash shoes. Well, practical inventions prevail. Let's take a look around the villa. Yeah, let's, let's do that. The old villa Ungafug. Right, we will burn our way through this level, call it a video. This has been a fun little intro to this game. I'm definitely going to play a bit more of this. Real sneaky. <laughs> the commando crawl just with two guns. You can see it's all walking around in there. Surveillance cameras, lasers, I'll take care of those. I hope there aren't any guard dogs too. Now that I think about it, I guess there will be some for sure. Well, you'll manage. And if not, I'll just go back to that forest and look for a new cat. Oh. <laughs> okay. I don't even know your name yet and you're just already replacing me? I see how it is. Oh, this is... Oh! <laughs> We've got a radio communicator. Hello. Is this on? Ah, you can hear me. I secretly slipped a radio into your jacket. Professional espionage. Anyway, I can't locate your tracking device anymore. Which I also gave you, by the way. Are you okay? Not that I care, but I hope you are. Well, we're doing well. We're just currently licking ourselves, so <laughs> we're doing okay. Thanks, friend. <laughs> Look at that painting behind us. Ooh. Oh, we can move the camera a little bit. Oh, I can see a secret up there. Okay, well, there's no way I can jump up there. I guess we'll have to go around. Hello! Ow! Immediately slapped me down. Okay. Pug! Gone. Droopy dog! Gone. Pug with a gun! Ow! Shot me in the face. Stop it! The key is to attack quickly. That was a poodle. There's now an ex-poodle. Take a bit of that. Is, that. is that a Pomeranian with a knife? Hello? Take a bit of that. Right, first things first. Get the secret. 
Uh, which may be down this hole. Oh my god, husky! Oh, there it is. Got it! Nice. And then there was a rope over here? Maybe that's another secret. I saw a reflection in the mirror. I thought it was something weird. Huh! Mind you, everything in this game has been weird so far. I'm a cat wearing a jacket. Wait a minute. Did I just bash my head on the ceiling? <laughs> what a fun little detail that is. Splat. Splat. Alright, I'll stop doing that now. I'm going to get a head injury. Whoop! Lovely. Right. We've got everything we need so far. Can I jump up there as well? I feel like there might be some secret hidden up there as well. Is there? Don't know. We'll find out when we get higher up. Pew! Oh, the pugs are a bit weedy. This music's got really dramatic as well. I remember the fun music from level one. Now it's getting like weirdly dramatic. I see a checkpoint. Give me it. That dog looks like he's got a mustache. I quite enjoy that. Hello. Ow. The huskies. The huskies are so vicious. Okay. Slide. Slowly. Sl there is nothing. Okay. That just leads back to the toilets. I thought there was going to be a puzzle piece or something in there. Oh, there is some ammo down there. Whoosh. Going down. Oh, that's all it was. Cool. Cat food. Oh my god. Just beat the hell out of that husky. Right, hang on a minute. Is there something down here? Oh, there is. Get out of here, dog. Oh, no, wait. This is the right way. Okay, hang on. Puzzle piece. I just have the urge to 100% all the levels. I'm going to have to go back and do the motorbike one. Because I struggled with that. Until I found out that you can... Melee attack. I wish I'd known that the first few times I tried it. We lost many lives to that motorbike race. Up. Doing. Oh, nice. Oh, give me it. Give me the coin. Yes, delicious. Doing. <laughs> I love how it does the proper cartoon like boing effect as well. Doink. Ow, pug. Pug with a gun. Goodness me, who'd have thought they were so vicious? Easy. Got an extra life, which we all know I need now. Nailed it. Ow! <laughs> you know, out of all the things I thought I was going to do on a Thursday afternoon, getting slapped by a poodle was not one of them. And there we go! Beautiful. 100%, 100%, 100%. I reiterate, best Super Cowboy player. Right, and that is where we're going to wrap up for this little preview video, but I really enjoyed that. It was a real lovely change of pace compared to all the games I've played recently. It's really nice going back and playing something super nostalgic, which obviously they've lent into hard with this game. With the graphics, the gameplay, the music. The music is excellent. Um, we're currently just looking at a cat licking itself in front of a fireplace, I realised. Let's go back to the main menu, and we'll listen to that lovely music while we outro. <laughs> awesome. This has been a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that. It's, like I said, it's nice to play something different that isn't super dark and gritty, and 100% uh, crazy laser story focused. Super Catboy does have a story, and I'm excited to see more of it, because I didn't expect that, to be honest. I mean, I expected there to be some sort of narrative. Surely you can't just be an adorable cat in a jacket wearing dash shoes and nothing else. And so far there is a story and it apparently involves genetic experimentation and a lot of dogs wearing military uniforms and carrying guns. But I'm sure we'll see more of that later and I will definitely be playing a little bit more of it. So hopefully you have enjoyed it as much as I have. Thank you again Pixel Pogo and Assemble Entertainment for providing a key to play Super Catboy. Like I said, the game is available on Steam right now. And also, like I said earlier, if you get there before Monday, the 31st of July, you will also get a 20% discount to celebrate the launch of the game. It has been a ton of fun so far. I really hope the soundtrack is on Spotify. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to give this video a like. Subscribe if you fancy. Check out the game for yourself. And I'll see you in the next video.